Welcome to another tutorial from How to Webmaster. Today, learn how to automatically post content from RSS feeds by using WP Robot. If you want to learn more about WP Robot, please check out my review video. The link is down below. Okay, once you're inside of your WP dashboard, in your WP Robot menu here, click on options. You, you will arrive here and then scroll to the source that says RSS feeds and then check the box and then just save and this will allow you to use the RSS feed as a source and here in the RSS feed tab that was just enabled here are some default settings this is the basic template for the RSS feed and you can customize it if you want I'll just leave everything as default for now and let's create a campaign okay here let's set the schedule time every 60 hours publish and then set as a post or page or whatever you want set the author and you can also choose to do add a keyword so my site is dog training so i want to make sure there's at least dog in the content or in the title or content and categories i'll just do dog news and now templates since you're using the RSS feeds, you won't see RSS down here. You have to select RSS campaign. Okay, now you can actually enter in your RSS feeds. And to find RSS feeds, just use your best friend Google here. Enter in your keyword and then RSS feed. And it'll give you a bunch of RSS feeds that you can use. My favorite is feedspot.com right here, top 100 dog RSS feeds or whatever keyword it will likely pop up feedspot.com and then you come here there's a top 100 dog or whatever keyword you want and this is pretty useful and you want to make sure that you copy the RSS feed link right here so copy that let's go back here and then paste it in one feed per line so you can do a few so let's do this one and then just copy a few all right I got three right here Let's go down. You can exclude any keywords. For example, you don't want cat, so you can type cat right there. But I'm pretty sure all of the RSS feed that I got are dog related, so there's no need to exclude. And then you can choose to rewrite and translate if you set those up. And you can choose to strip all of the links from the post, but it's not really recommended. So I'll just leave those, uh, I'll leave it unchecked. All right, let's create the campaign and check out how the RSS will look once it's posted to your blog. Let's go to the campaigns page. Let's run it right now. Okay, one article was created. Let's check it out. Okay, there it is. The whole entire article was successfully uh, generated. Okay, that works perfectly. Let's do another run. Let's see what the next one looks like. Okay, here it is. So this one is uh, looks okay. There's some uh, pretty weird looking boxes, but other than that, all the content's fine. And my theme right now is the default WordPress 2021 theme, so it doesn't actually look that good, but it'll fit uh, with your theme. WP Robot works with any WordPress theme. Okay, so that's uh, how easy it is to use WP Robot to Grab content from RSS feeds and post them to your blog. I hope this helps. Let me know if you guys have any questions. Be sure to subscribe to How to Webmaster for more tips, tricks, and tutorials on WP Robot and more WordPress tips and tricks. Thanks again, and until next time, happy blogging.